Hi everyone, CG Tier here, back with another video. Just a quick intro, so for this video in particular, we'll be looking at the voice actors for the Japanese dub of the Super Mario Brothers movie, with some highlights from the trailers we've seen so far, and my own reactions to it of course. With that out of the way, let us begin! Okay, starting off, we have Mario being voiced by Mamoru Miyono, who is known more recently for Voice in Skull or Ryuji from Persona 5 and Light Yagami or Kira from Death Note. It'll be funny if there's like a throwback line, I doubt it, if like he <laughs> Mario takes like a mushroom and like, bites into it. I'm sure there'll probably be memes of it on like Japanese 4chan or whatever. But yeah, looking forward to it. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick clip of his showcase. So, let's go. Up next, we have Princess Peach being voiced by Elisa Shida, who most recently, to my knowledge, played Elle from Blade Runner Black Lotus and Amanda from Little Witch Academia. I haven't really heard her too much, but from what I've heard from her Princess Peach, it's like the very, like, very good Ojo Summer type of voice as you guys will hear in this clip coming up. And coming up, we have Luigi being voiced by Tasuku Hatanaka, who most recently played, to my knowledge, Shreds from Fire Emblem Warriors Three Hopes and Charge Bolt from My Hero Academia. I'll be honest, it's kind of funny, even though Shreds was kind of a goofball as well as Charge Bolt to some degree, like he's like really taken up to a whole new, like, notch with Luigi. And you guys will hear that coming up right now. Okay, and time for the legendary Bowser, or as he's known in Japanese, Koopa, voiced by the legendary Kenta Miyake, who most recently will be playing Zangief from Street Fighter 6, and Kratos from the God of War series, as well as All Might from My Hero Academia. You guys can check him out in action right here. And he, he really does put on a good show for everyone, I'll, I'll be honest. <laughs> And penultimately, we have Toad, or as he's known in Japanese, Kinopio, being voiced by Tomokazu Seki, who's known for playing Rob Lucci from One Piece and Enrico Pucci from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Stone Ocean. I don't know, I guess he likes characters with like, tree, like a tree ending name, but I don't know, maybe it's a pun, I have no idea, but I'm like, power to you, man. And he's playing a character that's like the complete opposite of any of, the, of these two guys. <laughs> but anyhow, check him out in action. And lastly, we have Donkey Kong DK being voiced by Koji Takeda, who's known for playing Daruk from The Legend of Zelda, uh, Breath of the Wild. He might even come back for uh, the new game coming out. I have no idea if they're going to do like more flashback characters, but hey, only one can dream, right? And also Master Mummy from ARMS. Check him out in action right here. Okay, and that brings an end to my video. If you guys enjoyed it, feel free to leave a like, comment, and or subscribe if you feel inclined to do so. I would really appreciate it. I do want to cover more footage, maybe for like more videos like game movies and stuff like that. I probably will be doing future videos where I will be showcasing voice actors and stuff like that for your entertainment, of course. And on that note, I am actually interested in checking out the movie with the Japanese dub, of course, but Unfortunately, I'm not in Japan at the moment, but if I were to go to Japan, but I'm assuming there will probably be like a DVD, right, like later on, maybe you can buy it on demand or something on like Amazon Prime, like the Japanese one, or something like that. But if I can, then I'm definitely checking out the movie at some point, and I'll get back to you guys, <laughs> unless you guys get to it first before I do, if you're living in Japan at the moment. Tell me how it is, I'm really interested to hear that kind of stuff. Anyhow, until next time, take care and goodbye.